Mr. Tata continues to be an inspiration in the way he has a vision for the good and well-being of the country. And I think most of what I owe to him in social entrepreneurship, where I want the entrepreneurship activity that I have to be connected to some social good, not charitably, but through business models. I think it comes largely from him. Meet Shantanu Naidu. Known to be a close aide and special friend to business tycoon Ratan Tata. And when you have a mentor like Ratan Tata, one would wonder what the biggest learning would be. Businesses that are profitable can also take care of communities. Usually we have this misconception that a profit-making business is mutually exclusive from creating communities. And the Tata's 150-year legacy is evidence of that where Jamshedji Tata started with the cotton mills and the steel plants uh, as profitable businesses. But in that, he created communities, welfare for employees, welfare for the towns that he was building, all of those. So the Tata Group stands as an excellent example of how business profit and how taking care of communities and employees is not mutually exclusive. Uh, that is my biggest learning. If you spend enough time with someone and if you spend that time observing them and observing how they do things and why they do certain things, there's a lot to learn in that proximity. That can be a good thing and a bad thing. Unfortunately, with him, it's an excellent thing because it's years and years of wisdom accumulated in one individual that you get to see firsthand. So I always try to keep my eyes and ears open as to what decisions are being taken, why are they being taken. And if I don't understand, just asking what his thought process was behind it. But it has never been a situation where he sits down and tells me, these are the three things you should follow in life. Never happened that I have sat down with him and he's given me knowledge in the form of knowledge. It's by observation. And on the personal front, he has been a staunch supporter of my ventures. I really appreciate that. He's been a great friend, great sounding board. And all of those relationships only continue to grow at this. A popular saying goes, you are who you surround yourself with. While Mr. Tata's proximity to Shantanu has helped Shantanu find a direction where he can work for a greater cause, Shantanu's steps are now paving the way for others to follow. Perhaps this is what great mentors and teachers do. More than imparting knowledge, they inspire change. Subscribe to Midday India. Get direct notifications on all our videos by clicking on the bell icon.